80 years ago, the international financial system was set up to protect the world from deep economic and financial crisis. But today, the system is broken. Financial support must enhance all states' capacities to invest sustainably in all human rights, including economic, social, and cultural rights, and the right to development. Urgent reform of the governance of international financial institutions, including the World Bank and the International Monetary Fund, must also transform their economic paradigm. To firmly anchor macroeconomic policies and financing decisions in human rights,